Would you like to offer your users recurring payments? Let me show you how. Hey everyone, welcome to JotForm. I'm Kimberly, and this is really helpful if you need to collect money on an ongoing basis from your users. Maybe it's donations, or maybe you are a coach and you have a subscription option to where people can pay you every single month for your coaching abilities. We have a really simple way. So right now I have a form that's already kind of started. I have the name and the email. So what we are going to do is we're gonna go over to the left-hand side under the form elements, we're gonna choose payments. We are going to choose PayPal personal. Now, if you prefer to use Square, definitely check out the help article. There is more information about utilizing Square recurring payments for that. But over on the right-hand side, under payment type, we have some different options. It's going to automatically populate on sell products, but we want to sell subscriptions, which is this one right here. If you are going to use this to collect donations, you will definitely choose that one. But I'm going to use sell subscriptions and then I'm going to enter my PayPal account email and then I'm going to hit continue. All right, it is time to set up this subscription for the recurring payments. I'm gonna go ahead and choose the create a new one and I'm gonna create a paid coaching option. So I'm gonna go ahead and name this subscription coaching and then the price for my coaching will be $50. And then uh, we'll do that as a monthly. We can choose what that looks like by weekly, by monthly. I think monthly is good. And then we can also set up the number of payments. If this is gonna be ongoing, we'll choose no limit. But if there is a specific time, maybe it's a six month coaching program, we can choose that. But I'm gonna go ahead and leave it at no limit. If we wanna add images, we can. If you want to have a variable price, you can do that as well. If you would like to set a custom first payment, you can do that as well. So let's say that the first payment for me is going to be $25. If we want to set a trial period, we can. So let's say the trial period is three days. I guess we could say that the first payment is going to be $0, right? because that's a trial, $0 for three days. And then yes, we do want this selected by default because this is the whole reason for the form. All right, let's go ahead and click save. Good deal. So over on the right hand side, we can see we have my coaching subscription. It is free for the first three days. And after that is $50 a month indefinitely. So I'm gonna go ahead and show this. Perfect. And let's take a look at the form and see what this looks like. Good deal. So we can see that it is automatically chosen. So they have to choose that. And it's as simple as that. If you have any questions about setting up recurring payments, definitely let us know and I'll see you next time.